Hey there. End of a Sunday. Taking a gander right now. You're looking at the uh, the greenhouse or what's left of it. <laughs> There's not a lot out here. Um, we have uh, pretty much done planted everything we got to plant. I meant to uh, show you the the uh, compost tea gadget I've got over here. It's right here. You see I got my spigot down there. Over here is my air pump. Two lines. Runs up. Goes down in there where I have a bag of uh, yard compost which includes but not limited to chicken, goat, and a little rabbit along with some minerals. A little trailer I picked up the other day. Um, yeah, that's my compost tea. You see my, my lawn growing under my wife's car? That's splendid. Oh, uh, anyway, I wanted to show you the garden. I've got a, uh, everything I had extra of I put over here. So I've got in this bed here all kinds of stuff. Uh, cabbage, peppers, jalapenos, bell peppers, uh, serranos. I've got uh, tomatoes, cucumbers, all kinds of stuff. As you see, my I pumped out that one put it in some other storage bins. That's why, if you notice the line right there, Over here's our cucumbers growing up the fence. Um, you see I I set up these posts and then uh, some old fence piece I had and my cukes are growing up there nice. I have some more over here that are going a little ballistic on me and I gotta get this guy here didn't get the memo, I guess. He seems to want to go the other way. Sorry about that. Oh, and here's my peas. Hopefully you can see that. I don't know. It's so bright out here, it's hard to see what I'm seeing. And there's all my onions. Yeah, had a little problem with them. Unfortunately, the uh, the hot and the cold has caused them to go. When you use uh, sets instead of plants, sets are second year growth, which means they can go to seed quickly. So now I will never use sets again. I will always use plants. These are my bunching onions here. I don't know if you can see these guys or not. Well, I guess so. They've already pretty much raided the, the radish bed here, as you see. And then here's my, uh, my, co my uh, broccoli. Like I said, I'm having a hard time seeing. We have lots of different plants growing here. You can see all the way down. Got lots more weeding to do. I'm not weeding the walkway. That's what's all grassy. And these are my uh, garlic plants. I've only got what three, six of them. This is the big one. This is the uh, this is the potatoes. Um, talk about going to town. These guys are going ballistic. That little guy down there. And this is where we started. It was down here. Well, I haven't put anything on this layer here. But what I did do is I've been hilling the rest of them. And every time I hilled them, they grow higher. So as... Uh, my dad so jovially put it, hopefully there's something underneath. Well, I'm pretty sure there is. 
I'm going to have to break out the shovel. Uh, fortunately, I've only got this much compost left. It's not, uh, it's not a lot. Might have to go digging around. Strawberries are doing well. Here's my new system for my uh, tomato plants. Yeah, lots of weeds. But I'm doing a string system. I was supposed to put the next set of strings up today, but uh, got stuck doing some work on the barn. And I just couldn't stop doing that. I had to finish. And over here, we've got uh, our, our uh, we got six mounds over here. Each one has uh, different things. We've got uh, pumpkins, uh, squash, straight neck summer, and uh, we've got uh, planted watermelon. Don't know if they're going to come up. Um, and I got another hill over there that doesn't have anything on it. That is, again, some more pumpkins that I just seeded, so we'll see what happens. And over in the compost area, rather than waste that space and those plants that I grew in the greenhouse, rather than letting them die off, we went ahead for fun just to plant them in the uh, compost and see what they do. If they die, well, then I don't have very far to throw them into the compost pile. If they live, well, you never know what we might get. We can get a whole bunch of cucumbers. We've already got a zillion plants, so we're going to be overrun with cucumbers. Um, like I said, I've been working on the barn all day. and A new barn door on the back side and a new run area. Trying to get ready to get some pegs. Here's my other three tanks. The one on the end down there is completely full. This one here, as you can see, is almost to the second level. And then that one there isn't very high. It's so it's not bad. The center one is the collector. The two outside one are storage. Um, 275 gallons each. And uh, I have them plumbed so I can hook up to them and, and uh, drain them. Rose bush is doing well this year. Look at that. Oof. Go way back. Let's go way back. There we go. So we're doing all right. Um, it's kind of warm today. Another bed with uh, all kinds of weird stuff in it. Anyway, um, I'm not uh, going to go walking back to the barn. Not right now. Tomorrow we've got some other things to do. I'm not going to work, so we'll, well maybe we'll uh, film a little bit more later. It's a beautiful day. Garden's growing great. Y'all have fun now.